Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another episode and another adventure. Hope you're all doing well. At least an hour of sunlight. Chili. Good morning everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Looks a little different in here. Yes, as by the title, I did buy my dream vehicle. So I am sitting inside my Jeep Wrangler. If you own a Jeep, you don't need to watch this because you already know. But for those of you that don't, check it out. It's pretty cool. I have not been able to put out a video, uh, an adventure video for a couple of weeks. And there's a good reason for that. I recently got a new position at work. And same employer, just different position. I have been trying, well I've been working hard at getting this position and it's a pretty tough competition to get so I'm pretty proud of that, that I, that I made it through. Uh, one of the requirements is five years on the job before getting into this position. Basically, I am now going to be an instructor uh, at my workplace. My schedule is going to change, which is good. Uh, it's a whole new experience and a new career path. So I'm pretty happy about that. Having said that, that's the right reason why I haven't been, up, been able to get out to film. Because two weeks ago, I was away for a week. For training this past week I was in Ottawa for training I'm going back out of town tomorrow I guess for another week of training for this position so I have not been able to get out and film and trust me I've wanted to but I just it just couldn't happen now when I was closing the sale we had all the numbers crunched the trade-in from the red truck that I had you seen those that in some videos um, you know because I'm a smart ass and right at the end said oh we're good to go yeah okay and I'm like wait no 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 wait 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 there's one other thing I want a Jeep hat <laughs> so the sales guy he kind of laughed or whatever and he's like I'll buy you a Jeep hat okay and the funny thing is when I went to pick it up after everything was done I went to pick it up we did everything else and then he actually had on the full bill of sale he included the Jeep hat so I, I was just joking around so anyways I guess we'll switch out there you go Kind of, I don't, I'll have to check the angle, but you can see the Jeep. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you what's going on here, and uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited. I've only had it for a couple of days, and I absolutely love it. I have wanted a Jeep probably since the day I started driving. I've always had SUVs, but I have wanted a Jeep, and so this is my dream vehicle, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be some fun. So this is the Jeep Sahara. JK Unlimited and it is it's fully loaded. It's got everything that that I need um, The nice thing with this one is that this section right here I can take off just this portion of the roof. I don't have to take the back off So it's basically like having a sunroof, which is pretty cool. I Don't know. What can I tell you six-speed? manual transmission. Yes, that's right. I am back to using a stick shift which I'm looking forward to. I like to use uh, uh, manual when uh, I'm driving off road. I prefer that. Um, all right, well, let's take a look and see what she's got. Not brand new, but it's brand new to me. And I don't think the person that owned this before me really took it off road, because I'll show you, this thing is in mint condition, spotless. All right, let's hop outside. There we go. My Jeep Wrangler. What are you saying, Wrangler? Are you saying Wrangler? So here we go. This is the Jeep Wrangler JK Unlimited. White with all full black trim, which is 
Well, I wasn't really too particular on the color. I kind of thought I would like to get a white one, but uh, you know what? I like it, black roof, black accents. Uh, we'll take a look back here. So there you go, look at it. This thing is spotless, guys. Except for my lens cover is not spotless. We might have to start that over again. Is that better? So there you go. My little Mexican blanket on there. But take a look at this, spotless. So whoever had it took really good care of it and or they just didn't even go off road with it. Here I got the 18 inch rims. These are the stock uh, tires that come with it. Um, I am going to be changing out the rubber because I want something a little more aggressive, maybe a little bit bigger. I'm not going to go crazy with jacking it up and everything else because it already has really good clearance. I need my gloves. It's freezing. <laughs> it's cold gnarly gnarly cold outside and yes i said gnarly i'm allowed to because i'm old like that speaking of old thank you for all the birthday wishes yes i recently turned 50. can you believe that and uh yeah tons of birthday wishes and everything else from everybody so thank you so much for you guys hear that, that wind all right enough enough of that let's take a look and see what we got some inserts that are going to fill in the gaps right here and it helps to protect the rad go so you can see this is the section where it splits right here so i can take just this part of the roof off so i got myself a little sunroof i need my gloves oh, it's too cold it's too cold look at this this thing is spotless other than <laughs> dog hair already that can't be helped when you have two dogs okay with this one um it's basically come fully loaded so 3.7 v6 engine six speed manual transmission i showed you that uh four-wheel drive obviously cruise control the thing too uh heated seats that was a big thing for me this one's got the heated seats comes fully loaded it's got the big uh the speaker bar up in the roof you can see there right so this this whole roof section this is all speakers up through here, right? There are some of the clips to take the uh, the roof off. All of the padding for the roll bars were included. So it basically had had everything. I did get them to throw in. These are the WeatherTech mats, so they're custom fitted for it. Really good. Help to protect the uh, help to protect keep the salt and stuff off the uh, fabric. They didn't really put it through its paces. So let's have a look open up Let's see how spotless this is there we go i did get them to throw in this was one of the things too is this uh cargo liner uh so a nice big thick rubber cargo liner so that's going to help to protect it and keep stuff from sliding around uh, i got some of my usual accessories tools tow ropes straps kit shovel the usual stuff for traveling booster cables i'm gonna get this sorted i'm going to get some kind of a a bin um that's that i can have fitted in here so stuff won't uh move around and maybe one of the stretchy uh cargo nets and uh yeah two-thirds one-third split seats and this there's enough room in the back here that i could lay down and put an air mattress in here to do some camping and i could sleep in the jeep which I'm definitely gonna do. Full weather speaker. So I got a waterproof speaker in the back, in the trunk, which pumps out some pretty good bass. Um, let me tell you, this stereo kicks in this thing. Obviously, I can't play it because of copyright, so I can't put any music on, but I'll tell you right now, the stereo pumps is pretty good. The thing is I had the roof rack on the red truck, but I can't just swap it out. And Jeeps are kind of, funny that way as far as roof racks so i've been kind of researching but i definitely need to get a roof rack because i carry the kayaks paddleboard all of that stuff i have a cargo carrier to put on the roof too if i needed some more room um as far as any other accessories going other than the tires i'm gonna be changing out i have the front inserts um maybe a winch in the future i'm not gonna be doing any like crazy crazy off-road adventures well, yeah, I will, but I'll just try not to get stuck. 
I've got lots of space underneath here. Um, the one thing I have been looking into, apparently these headlights are not the brightest, the stock headlights. Um, so you can get some replacement ones, maybe some LED lights um, that are brighter and possibly some uh, extra fog lights. You can get fog lights mounted or a bar going up on the top. Um, just for you know if i'm on the trails at night i can uh I can get some real good visibility i haven't been able to get out and do an adventure but you can imagine the adventures that i'm going to be doing in a couple of weeks bear with me i gotta get through my training at work then once i get sort of onto my regular schedule trust me i'm anxious to get out in this in an adventure Maybe a winter camping one, maybe sleep in the back of the Jeep or something. That would be pretty cool. Tons and tons of adventures to come up. So you can imagine the channel is going to take a little bit of a, not a, a detour, but yeah, maybe a detour, a little off-roading adventure series. There's my news. There is my dream vehicle, my Jeep Wrangler Sahara JK Unlimited. Really happy. I, I, I don't even know what to say. I have wanted one of these for ever and ever and ever and ever. So we're going to have some fun. I'm going to be taking you on some pretty gnarly adventures this year. 2022, new job, new Jeep. It's looking good. Uh, I can't complain. I, I, I don't know what to say. I'm pretty lucky. I, I, I really am. So thanks for watching. Bear with me. I will have an adventure coming up shortly and uh yeah i still have to name it so give me an idea i don't know i, I gotta name the jeep so i don't even know what, what to think so there you go Woo! i got a jeep <laughs> see it says so on the hat the things i do for youtube man it's cold outside oh crap fantastic